Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Can we just take a moment and appreciate this little jacket? Oh my gosh. It's all of my Mickey dreams come true. Like literally, I love it. Secondly, you're gonna have to excuse how I look right now. I just took a shower and that is why my hair looks the way it is. And I also got sick again, again. I was literally fine for like two days and then starting yesterday, I got like this horrible sore throat and I still have a sore throat, but I do sound a little better this time, but I don't know. I don't know what's going on. And that's probably why like it's so cold to me in my house. So that's why I put on this jacket. It's so cold. I don't know. I don't know, like I turned off the AC and everything and it's still freezing. So hopefully I'm not getting a fever, but anyways, I wanted to just quickly jump on here and share my Ipsy bag with you guys. I actually already looked into this Ipsy bag, which is why I totally lost the little pink cover to it. But anyways, so I guess the theme is flying colors. So the first item is this Formula 10.06, I don't know if that's the brand, 3 times Sublime 3-in-1 Blackhead Wash plus Scrub plus Mask. And this is the Pink Grapefruit and Jojoba scent. I did try this out just like 20 minutes ago <laughs> and it was alright. Um, I was totally prepared to hate this facial scrub because as soon as I put it on, it started burning my face and it even says on the back, it's like, caution, a mild tingling or heating sensation is normal upon application. I don't know about mild, but it definitely did burn when I put it on. But after like the first two minutes, it I don't know if my skin died or went numb but uh, it stopped burning, <laughs> so it was all right. You have to leave this on for 10 to 15 minutes. I left it on for 15 minutes, and I think it did a pretty good job, actually, from getting for getting rid of like blackheads and stuff, but um, I don't know if I would like personally go out and purchase this, but I mean, I only used it like 20 minutes ago, just once, so... Um, if I do change my mind, I will totally update you guys on the description box below. In the description box below. And this also exfoliates your skin as well. There's like little micro beads. So once the mask is dried, you kind of rub it off in circular motions. And it does slightly exfoliate your skin as well. So that's a plus. The second item in the bag is this Dr. Lily Fan Probiotic Eye Repair Cream. And it's supposed to, I, I believe it's for like dark circles. I did not use this yet, but this smells so fresh and clean. But I'm most likely going to pass this on to my mom or something because I normally don't use like under eye brightening creams. Um, maybe I should, I don't know, but <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and pass this on to my mom. But it smells really, really good. The next item in the bag is this Beauty For Real eyeliner, and it's in the shade Whiskey. And I already took off the plastic because I did not want to deal with that while I was filming. So it is this beautiful brown eyeliner, and I love that it's retractable. That's always the best type of eyeliner because you don't have to worry about sharpening it but mine does not wind up <gasps> what it's not winding up or down let's just try it out so it went on very smoothly but it's not pointed enough to do a wing so i didn't even attempt that um but i really do like the color it's kind of shimmery and i don't know i like it the next item in the bag is this guy this is i don't know it says nomad stockholm midnight sun 
and this is an illuminated highlighter powder oh i thought it was an eyeshadow but okay Ooh. so it says a smooth blendable highlighter with fine champagne pearls and infused with black currant extract to help illuminate your skin inside and out free of parabens phthalates and mineral oil interesting and it's cruelty free and vegan so that's awesome oh this is so cute look at this <laughs> this is the cutest little packaging oh my gosh uh this is in the shade midnight sun oh my gosh <sighs> that is so cute i love tiny little packaging like it's so adorable let's see oh wow that is really soft and pigmented i'm gonna try some on the eyes first let's try this baby out on the face that though oh my gosh obviously this is too much highlighter but i just can't stop wow i was not expecting this like at all it is so bright oh my gosh i don't know if it's coming off on camera like it is like in real life but oh my goodness and the last and final item in the box for this month is this MAC lip gloss. This is so exciting. Never tried one of their lip glosses before. Um, this is in the shade See Through. It's like a very light, peachy skin tone lip gloss. Ooh, oh, it smells delicious. Mm. I most definitely would never wear this by itself. Um, I don't know, I feel like I look extra sick with like concealer lips, glossy concealer lips, like ugh. But uh, I would put like a lip liner underneath to kind of help the shade out a little bit. Okay, so I took the lip gloss off and I'm going to try applying it with a lipstick underneath. Um, this one is called Teddy Bear from Milani. Now I'm going to apply that MAC lip gloss in the center. Okay, so much better. Okay, I just tried to wing out my liner just a little bit because the no wing was kind of weirding me out for some reason. I don't know. So if I were to pick out my favorite item in this month's bag, I would definitely choose the highlighter this was just crazy good i'm still surprised that it was so pigmented I, I wasn't expecting much i think because it was just so tiny but expect big things out of tiny packages that's what we've learned everything else was all right not the best but i mean this is only 10 bucks a month so i can't complain too much comment down below what you guys got in your ipsy bag this month did you guys get something different did you guys get the exact same thing were you disappointed let me know all right guys so that's it for my ipsy bag unbagging i hope you guys enjoyed please subscribe if you haven't already give this video a big thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next video bye